What we're going to make is deep fried, batter dipped, a pig's feet, a staple of life. And what I did is I put the pig's feet and hormones I'm using tonight, any brand is good. Cut them, wash your hands, clean up and everything, and then just get at it. I'm going to have to cut away a little bit occasionally so that I can get all of this in because it's well worth. You don't have to take no notes, just pay attention. Deep fried pickled pig's feet. I have a pancake batter. I use pancake and waffle mix, great value, 99 cents. You cut these pig feet into little, little squares about three quarters of an inch. You put them in a pancake batter several of them. Now I have the oil heating up and you want that oil hot to when you drop one of these little morsels in there it seals the outer coating. I tell you what some people says that they don't like pig's feet wouldn't eat one on a bit but yet to go down there and get them a hot dog if you eat a hot dog you'll eat anything. The oil is heating and by all means if you have to buy a cooking instrument it should be a thermometer so you know how hot your oil is when you put it down in there. Anyways, I do have one. I'm heating the oil up. These are in the batter. And what I'm going to do is put some cornmeal on a paper plate, just a small amount. I am using Martha White. Just use what you got. I do have some pig's feet left on the side. When you're deep frying, deep fry everything. Anyways, I happen to have two jars of pickles pig's feet. The, uh, the duct tape girl sourced these somewhere. And I've got the oil in there. It is over 200 degrees because that's all my thermometer will go to. So I do know it's hot enough. I have the pickles pig's feet uh, in the batter. And what you do is the pancake batter, the pickles pig feet dunked in yonder. You take them out and I'm gonna get I'm gonna get one of them out here. Make sure it's completely coated with the pancake batter and bring it over here and put it in the cornmeal and roll it around like that. And then you drop it in the hot oil and instantly they start frying. This is a deep fried pickles pig feet. You want to fry them at a very hot temperature. And you do have to keep a count of them because you want them to be a golden brown. They do fry really fast and I would Normally, if I wasn't with a camera, I would make up a whole bunch and fry at one time. The way it is now, I am, I'm going to cut that heat back a little bit. And uh, but this one right here, put it out on a, put it out on a paper towel. And these are frying almost perfectly. Can you hear the sizzle? Deep fried pickled pig's feet. It's the most delicious thing you have ever eating. eating. I'm doing these one at a time. Uh, so I'd have some talking time. If you, I'm not trying to sell you on the after tubes of a deep fried pickled pig feet. I'm just telling you it's there for your choosing. I would suggest it over a, a weenie, a hot dog. Definitely choose deep fried pickle pig's feet and uh, well Paula Dean hon ain't no butter miss the recipe but I stand right there with you on that sodium content call me now this is what we started with pickled pig's feet this is why I let them put them on a paper towel to dry a little bit I diced them up the pickles pig feet and uh, I used a pancake batter, drenched them, and I used a, if you were taking, if you were, you didn't have to take notes, but if you've seen it, I used a cornmeal coating, 
and this is actually what we this is what we baked right here I tell you what these little these little batter dipped cornmeal dressed pickled pig's feet deep fried there is absolutely nothing better on this planet by all means you can you can uh, a little light or a little dark a pickled pig's feet oh they are the most delicious most delicious thing you have ever eaten it's right up there close to ambrosia pickled pig's feet batter dip deep fried hey y'all check back now batter dip i tell you what these little feathers are good i tell you what I go and see if you cook these right here, you will make a comment. The most delicious thing you've ever cooked. I'll tell you what, Betty, Harm, take notice. This will be the winner at the State Fire this year. Deep fried pickle pig feet. The most delicious thing you've ever eaten. They, they are the most, with a little sour cream on the side right here, some dip, this would absolutely be the Go ahead and make some, take them to work, see what they think. When you deep fry these, you want to be cautious because the oil is hot. Now, I'll tell you what, you on your own, when it comes to how good are they for you, because they do got some sodium in there. You Well, if you have to, you have to, but don't eat too many of them. I actually prefer to fry them a little bit darker as considered to the light. I, I like the darker. I believe that should be the shade that you shoot for. Deep fried pickled pig's feet.